Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Um, I've had a few requests from fellow yogis and friends to share some of my cooking recipes. Sharing with you how being a vegetarian or vegan doesn't necessarily mean your food is boring. You can get very creative with things like salads amongst many, many other healthy, easy to make lunches and dinners and breakfast options. Those of you that already follow my blog will have my daily smoothie recipe that I'm very passionate about. I do this every single day, Monday to Sunday. Um, today I'm going to do a video making a creative salad, sharing a few tips. I love to play with um, different things, adding fruits and avo and fig even to your salads, including almonds and sunflower seeds. So pop me a comment down below and I hope you enjoy. So here are some of my ingredients. Um, before we start this video, I'd like to show you my preferred fruit and veg wash. I always wash all my ingredients before starting. So, over here we've got some butter lettuce, some red lettuce, a little bit of lemon and ginger, cucumber, figs, chive, some green olives, over there. <laughs> two tomatoes, some fresh basil leaves, an apple, and then my base, which I've already chopped up, you can see, is rocket and some finely chopped up celery as well. I'm also going to be using some almonds and sunflower seeds. The avo I will save for last, as we know if we chop it up now it'll go brown. Okay, let's get started. Okay, I've started with my base. See, I've just added the lettuce, give it a nice toss so it's fresh, and we're going to slice the cucumber. Get it ready. And next, we're going to add the tomato. I know this might seem very basic. Everybody knows you add lettuce, tomato, and cucumber to salads, but you can make them really creative and really delicious. Another thing I really love um, adding are things like pawpaw and blueberries. It's not everyone's taste buds. Some people might be like, "What is this woman talking about adding fruit to salads?" But Give it a try with the tastes that appeal to you and you'll surprise yourself how delicious it is to add things like blueberries and pawpaw to salads. So today I am going to add a bit of apple. And if you're not a fan of having spring onion in your salad, you don't have to add it. This is just what I've been craving, so I'm adding it in. And I really love ginger. I use it in a lot of my recipes, actually any chance I get. To use raw ginger, I just absolutely love it. It's got so many health benefits and it just tastes amazing. I actually find the more I eat it when I don't have ginger for a day, which is very, very rare, um, I'll actually crave it. So I just chop it up nice and fine. If you'd prefer to fry up some of your ingredients first, if you don't like it raw, then you could add it in after. Then I'm going to take the figs. Just slicing them off like that and cut them in half again. And 
And on the second one. This is looking delicious. And sprinkle the olives on top, very easy. Save the lemon for last. And then I'm gonna take the basil leaves and I just break them up. Fresh basil, adding that on top. Looking really, really good now. Next, I'm going to sprinkle in some of my almonds just on the top. And sunflower seeds. And next, we're going to have the avo. Slice the avo in half like this. When I serve a portion for myself because I'll probably use some of this for lunch tomorrow as well then I'll add the avo on top squeezing a bit of lemon juice and obviously if you like things like balsamic glaze but look how good that looks so you've got all your delicious ingredients and how fast was that healthy and yummy so for my salad today I just added a little bit of avo there with balsamic glaze on top and a little bit of goat's cheese. That's the end result. And dinner is served. I hope you enjoyed these tips on how to make creative salads. I will be doing more videos on various lunch, dinner and breakfast recipes. If you have any questions about natural health, being vegetarian, um, even vegan, and you've got some health queries or you'd like extra tips, comment down below and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.